Hello Internet! In this video, I'm going to be unboxing the Funko Pop figures from Smallville. Now, I never really actually saw Smallville outside of a few isolated episodes, but I'm a diehard Superman fan nonetheless. So let's take a look-see. For starters, let's look at the back of the box. Here we have, essentially, all five characters from the collection. A Clark Kent opening up his shirt, a bald Lex Luthor with a gun, Clark Kent with an S on his shirt, is he wearing boxers? I don't know. We'll find out when we open it up. The Green Arrow and Miss Lois Lane herself. All right, let's open these up. Okay, so here we have them all unboxed. Here we have Lex Luthor wearing a white suit. So clearly not the most fashionable of fellows, but nonetheless quite a bit of detail. White tie, white pants, white shoes. Incredibly bald. To the best of my understanding, Smallville is a uh, adolescent high school college age version of Superman. So I'd assume Lex Luthor would also be equally young. Not necessarily normal for characters of this age. I'm sorry, people of this age to be bald. Maybe alopecia. Either way, nonetheless, I didn't really watch the show. But here's Lex. Here we see Clark Kent opening up his shirt to reveal his Superman uniform. All in all, a pretty decently well put together pop figure. They gave them all four fingers, something they usually don't do on most cartoon or animated characters. So kind of nice that the Funko Pop guys went along and gave him all four fingers. Um, this was open for the first time on this video. There's some imperfections on the back of at least this Pop figure. It might be trying to make it look like there's wrinkles or I got a freaking dud. Here we have Miss Lois Lane. Incredibly long hair. Ain't nothing wrong with that. She also has some very nice Hillary Clinton cankles. Uh, that's not an attack on the Democrats or Miss Clinton herself, but she has a unique set of ankles. And Lois Lane has them too, apparently. Uh, like many female pop figures, they went with very small feet. Can't stand up, so we do have a stand. Here is Clark Kent wearing what appears to be boxer shorts, but they are afraid to imply that they're jeans. But there's also an elastic waistband. What's going on? Sorry, should not have been so animated. Really doesn't freaking matter. Um, full head of hair on this version of Clark Kent. Um, not like it matters. Different type of haircut. Ho ho, Funko. You designers are working overtime on this. Of course, here we have the Green Arrow. Well, you can tell he's the Green Arrow, even if you're not too familiar with the character, because he is green and has an arrow. Now, granted, by that same logic, you could also get confused and call him the Green Bow, the Caucasian Shoes. Either way, here he is. He's looking slick. Some observations I noticed about the set. It seems that, for the most part, it's the same model design for the Lex Luthor and shirtless Clark Kent. You can see the arms and feet are almost entirely uniform, with just some aesthetic additions or changes to each. Well, that rounds out the video. Please check back soon for other unboxing videos. Until then, take care.